Yo, welcome back to my channel. Uh, this is my second video now, uh, doing a little vlog type thing. Um, so today we're gonna be looking at something that I quickly featured at the end of my last YouTube video. Um, I was gonna do a full review on it, but I say driving around to different places to get a nicer location. But today it is what it is. I've just found somewhere just in the middle of absolutely nowhere. So today we're going to be looking at my Nissan GTR. Cool. So currently I drive an 09 plate black edition Nissan GTR in red. Personally, I love the red. It's cool. It's different. You don't see many of them in red. Um, I've also got it on max load air eye suspension. Uh, a lot of people ha probably haven't heard of max load. I was probably one of the first people in the country that had one of their kits on my 435i that I had. So it's about two videos ago now. So if you want to have a look, quick look at that, go ahead. But it, it sits pretty well, to be fair. Uh, it's on the floor. You don't see many of them on air eye, but I thought, well, let's just be a bit different. People have a lot of track spec, but I like, I do show cars, so I like it like this. But it is currently uh, stage two remaxed by Night Racer. So I'll put their link in the description below so you can check all of them out. But it is currently running around 600 brake. It has Godzilla mode on it, which means I can shoot flames at the back, stupid backfires. I can scare the hell out of anyone I want to. It's fun. <laughs> it's mad like, i'll try and get some videos for you soon at night when i do a video at night i'll show you some clips of it of people filming me but it is nuts like it is the best car i've probably ever owned in my life so i've had a few cool little like so i would say sporty cars but cars that are made into sport cars but i had a 350z before that was absolutely nothing compared to this thing um i'm only 22 as well so for me to have one at my age as well is mint it's my dream car it's something i always wanted and i'm just so happy i bought one but yeah this is it i'll go through a couple of little cool clips with you now of around the car and we'll go from there does a gtr cost to run um i daily this thing so it costs a lot more to run than what other people would say it would because well i drive mine every single day um soon i won't be driving as much due to i'm starting a new job so i'm going to be driving a van a lot so this thing won't be driven as much as it does now this is a a daily thing so it will only really be driven on weekends so obviously my fuel bill is going to go a lot less but I currently spend let's say for 280 miles so let's say all the way from down south down in dorset all the way up to around york south yorkshire you're probably looking at about 70 to 80 pounds uh, for me that's actually not that bad to be honest because i'm used to that in some of my older cars my 435i before was about the same my 350 actually costs more to run than this does um the only thing about this car is the maintenance uh the maintenance on this car obviously they would class it as a supercar so you need to maintain a hell of a lot more than you do in most other cars so you probably have a service every six thousand miles or six months uh which whichever comes first for me <laughs> daily in it um it came within two months because i did just over six thousand miles in it but that interim service only cost me about 150 quid so that's not too bad to be honest it's like just a normal service like oil change just checking bits and bobs um but then when you go on to doing the major service which a lot of people do for around 10,000 miles or every year or two however often they drive it that's when it costs more that's when you're looking at more or less around at least 1500 quid 2000 plus uh depends where you're going to be honest 
Um, but apart from that, it's not too bad. Insurance for me as a 22 year old, uh, I've only got two years, no claims. And a 50 50 against me a few years ago, which wasn't my fault, but there's no witnesses, no nothing. So they took a couple of years, no claims off me. So that did damage it a little bit for me, but it wasn't actually that bad to be honest because considering I'm only 22 driving a car like this uh, I only pay with all mods declared and everything as well so that's declaring my blow-off valves my remap oh, it's bumpy. Um, my air ride and everything I only pay around 1150 1200 I think it is so that's actually all right to be honest um, I could deal with that. That's cheaper than some of my other cars I had before. Like I used to have a course of it XR when I was just 18. Uh, that cost two and a half grand to insure. But yeah, yeah, it's not too bad to be honest. I can't complain now at my age I am driving one of these. Like, like I said before, it's my dream car. Always wanted to own one ever since watching Fast and Furious um, where it showed the silver one. I was like, I want to own one of them one day. So now, it's a bit of time later since the film came out but yeah wicked absolutely wicked car it's a driver's car it does everything you want it's all-wheel drive it's got the power it's got absolutely everything there that you want i'm going to try and go past its horses yeah, there we go thank you um but yeah apart from that that's the car to be honest um there's going to be more videos coming of it soon once we get our lockdown i'm going to be starting to modify it because I want to take this to car shows this year if they're on COVID permitted but I've got a lot in store for this thing so for all you GTR fans out there like you you'll want to subscribe to the channel because there's so so much coming um, but apart from that that's it for today's video so if you enjoyed it you like it was it was a very quick video like I only took about half an hour of my day to do it I couldn't really go fast not much I could do but it's all I could get for now. Uh, but if you did enjoy it, please smash a thumbs up. Like, liking this video means the world to me. It would be great. Uh, if you could also subscribe, share the video around, let people know. Um, say, tell everyone about Convicted, which is my clothing brand. So I'm going to be doing a couple of videos on that because I do have more clothes coming out recently, um, soon. Um, so stay tuned for that. Uh, stay tuned for more videos coming up soon and enjoy the rest of your day or night or wherever it is <laughs> cool right take it easy and i'll see you later